U.S. President Donald Trump is looking at four potential candidates to fill the role of White House Chief of Staff. Sources tell Reuters the candidates include New Jersey Governor Chris Christie, one of Trump's earliest supporters for president. Um, I am proud to be here to endorse Donald Trump for president of the United States. It's not the first time Trump flirted with the idea of offering Christie a job in the administration. His name was first floated for attorney general, but that went to Jeff Sessions. It was then floated again when Sessions resigned last month, the former governor visiting the White House that same week. I did not see Chris Christie yesterday. I heard he was in the White House. He's a friend of mine. He's a good man. But the president tapping William Barr instead. Christie last year appeared to gripe about the fact he was pushed aside in his role running the president's transition team. Um, experience matters. The president's campaign was built on being an outsider who's going to come into Washington and change things. That's great. That's fine. I'm okay with that. But you cannot run a transition as an outsider. Whether he'll become a White House insider remains to be seen. The administration may not want the man blamed for the 2013 Bridgegate scandal overseeing Oval Office traffic. And Christie may find his ramp to the White House closed. You know, I'm, I'm honored to be considered. Yeah, Other candidates for chief of staff include hardline conservative congressman Mark Meadows. Sources say the president is also considering former campaign advisor David Bossie and U.S. Trade Representative Robert Lighthizer for the position. Trump is expected to announce his choice by the end of the year. The next chief of staff will be the third person to hold the job since Trump took office in 2017.